listening to Jan Talk. Go. We in the jungle, baby. Number one. Hey, hold up. Yo, it's the Gen Top Podcast with your boy Mike J. I got Groovy Drew, I got Shell, I got Trav. And today we're just recapping 2021. It was a crazy year. It was, it was, it was had its ups and downs. I don't know it did it top 2020 as far as like how you felt about it. I understand last year was crazy, but you know, it got even a little crazier this year with the whole virus and everything. But a lot of people we had a lot of progress this year. You know, a lot of growth. So I think it was a another win. How do y'all feel about it? Mm, I don't know. I think 2021 was for me. It's probably worse than last year. You think so? I, feel, I feel yeah. I feel like it was a lot of a lot more deaths this year than last year. Um. You know, with celebrities, we had we lost a lot of good celebrities. Yeah, we do. Um, a lot of deaths that hit home. Um, also with you know friends or whatever, and then the new uh two different strains came out this year: the Delta and then the the uh they call it Omarion now, but it's called the uh what's it it's called? Omarion. Omicron, 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 so I don't know. Yeah, so we ended up with two new strands of that. When I'm thinking, you know, 2020 was worse. And I'm thinking, okay, 2021 is going to be better with the whole COVID thing. And then it, it took it up a notch. Um, so I don't, I mean, I don't know. I feel like, uh, but my personal experience. Hello? Hello. Hello. You. I felt like I felt like I did more last like, yeah, year. You, than you, I did. Yeah, breaking up a little bit. Hello. Hello. I think you went on mute or something. Hello. Hello? Yeah, sound like yeah. We can hear you now. Yeah. Um, I don't even know why. I stopped coughing. You said you did a lot more this year than you did last year. Yeah, I feel like yeah, um, I, um, you know, like I said, I, it's sad to say, but even though you know the virus was new last year, I felt like I actually got out more and did more last year than this year. Um, I don't know. This year, I hope 2022 is better. I mean, I guess I did good job this year, so I can't complain too much. I just feel I, I think it's more so, um more deaths. I feel like Columbus got worse this year with the killings and the shootings versus last year. Mm-hmm. I don't know. This year's just crazy. Like, and I've been seeing, I made a post today, like, legit, like, so many deaths within probably the last two weeks I've been seeing up and down my timeline. And this ain't even, like, I don't even know what's, you know, happening with people, but it's young people. I mean, people in there my age or you know a little older i mean i don't know it's just it's sad yeah Yeah. especially all that crazy ass stuff that's going on now with that with that one case with the girl and everything you know what i'm saying it's like dang i said shoot growing up in columbus you didn't really see much of this you see it every now and then but you seeing this on a consistent basis like almost every day it's always something in the news so so I don't know. I don't know. I, I really feel like this year might have talked last year, my personal opinion. Say the topic. <laughs> hmm Yeah. I guess, girl. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, it, do. it seemed like it did, but you know, with all the people dying, especially celebrities and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we did. I mean, it's just like it's like you, it's kind of getting scary when you're getting older because usually, like, you're getting older and you just seeing people you know you grew up with, you know, some people moving away, some people passing away, and it's sad. And it's like you just seeing death every day, and it's just like people are getting numb to it. And it seems like nobody gives a damn about it. 
when you look at all this stuff that's going on these days and all that, and you think, you know what I'm saying? You just feel like the world ain't what it used to be. And when they said the end of the world happened, I kind of believe it because the world that we know and love back in the day is gone. Everything's different. Mm-hmm. So. Yeah, I, I know say- I've been seeing probably about, <laughs> I've probably seen about at least this whole week, I've seen about four different RIPs, four, maybe five different RIPs this week alone for people. I don't know about y'all. I don't know what y'all timeline looking like, but mine's been crazy, you know? And, you know, you just be wondering, like, what's going on with people? Like, what happened? And it's, I don't know. It's just, it's, it's I mean, like I said, I know that we ain't we ain't on this world to, to stay and everybody got their time, but, dog, like. Yeah. It's just like, damn, like, who, you know, who might be next? Like, just don't you know. know. Yeah. But you're right. You got to spend time. You know what I'm saying? You got to spend time with people. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you just got to nip stuff in the bud and just move on. And you know what I'm saying? Because you never know when your time is going to come, like you said. But I just feel like, I don't know. I don't know how we could change this whole how we be saying. Because my timeline, the same way, you see RIP, RIP, RIP. And I was like, damn, bro. Like, what's really going on? I don't know mm-hmm. if it's just, I mean, I, all you can do is really just pray and, you know what I'm saying, take care of your, take care of your family, your friends and family, and just make sure you, y'all in the right place at the right time and stay out of trouble. But yeah. nowadays, they don't care. So, not to sound all depressing and shit, but, yeah. Well, I can say for this year, you know, you know, a few things, good things. Like I said, I got a a better job, a new job this year, and you know, um, Carno finally paid off. Got that guy paid off. I'm excited about that. <laughs> One no. less deal. Yeah. I gotta work about. Um. So I mean, I, I mean, I got breath in my body. I can't complain, but um, yeah, I think it's just. Columbus and what's been going on with Columbus got me to where I'm like, I hope 2022 is, is better. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 222. The way it's looking like it's gonna be worse too. It's cool. Come on, it's just some, it is. I'm just saying, like, what's it got? A lot of a lot of business starting to close back down now because they ain't got nobody on work and that like, everybody's sick and stuff. So shoot. I don't know what going on with the government. Like they refuse to to shut down, but it seems like the people are taking to taking accountability and staying at home now. But you say what? Oh, I said yeah. I was agreeing with you that in 2020, um, 21. I meant um a lot of short staff jobs this year because yeah, I mean yeah. it took forever for us to get to hire some people. I mean, even they, I mean, they would have interviews and people wouldn't show up. Yeah, ain't I mean, how we it, it was so short staff at one point, like it didn't got better though, but yeah, a lot of jobs, short staff this year. Yeah, it's going to get um, even worse than that, man. People, like, people don't want to work and then shit, now nah, everybody's sick, so shit, can't, can't nobody work now, for real. Yeah. No. What's yeah. going on? Yeah. Drew said he probably gonna join in a minute, but um, yeah, I mean, I could say it's been a good year. Besides the whole, you know, Columbus and the whole environment and the stuff and the virus, I believe it was a good year and got a new job. The podcast took another step forward. You know what I'm saying? You know, we're taking baby step. Got the LLC. You know what I'm saying? Coming out with new merch. We got a website going in progress and we're trying to get out, push out some new merch, you know, for all the supporters and everything. You know, everybody's working on their health. Everybody's getting new money. You know, we, you know, doing different experience. We partied a lot this year. I ain't gonna lie, we, this is the most I party all my entire <laughs> life. Like I was going out almost every week. I need to sit my old ass yeah. down. Really? Hmm. 
I don't feel like about. I feel like I didn't party as much this year. I feel like I've been inside compared to you know my life. I, I think this was the most I've been inside. <laughs> I mean, it was like what eight weeks we was out. <laughs> like I was just out doing stuff and all that. So it was like eight weeks straight I was out and all that. that was, so that one and that one COVID had society a little bit. Yeah. But I mean it's been fun. Everything. I just feel like um that we got some more stuff in store, you know. I just, you know, I'm proud of everything that this podcast has turned into. I appreciate y'all time working on this and turning in this to a very, very, very notable um podcast. You know what I'm saying? So and we're gonna keep on doing, you know, keep on doing what we're doing. So we're just gonna keep on progressing next year we're just gonna take another we're gonna start doing shit that people are scared to do so we're just gonna whatever we're gonna get out of our comfort zone and we're just gonna take it to the next level that's all we can do these days because if you ain't gonna take it to the next level you're just gonna be stagnant and it's just gonna be next thing you know it's gonna be too look it's gonna be 2030 so you might as well just go ahead and chase your dreams and do whatever you want and live life you know, 2022, I'm definitely getting out, like, getting out of Columbus, like, doing stuff, like. So you gotta get if, out. If God allow me, I'm getting out, like. I'm looking for a new apartment right now, so. <laughs> and you know what? I, I think that might be my next step. Like I was telling y'all the other day, I think either that or trying to look for a house, like. But I think I want to, that'll be the next move for me. Yeah. New place. Yeah, new place. You know what I'm saying? New surroundings. Oh, everything. Oh, everything gonna be all right. I mean, it's gonna be all right. Exactly. I mean, yeah, we've been out all right for this long. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> for me, it can't get no worse. I mean, how? I mean, that's I how. Don't say that. No. <laughs> I feel yeah. like it can't get no worse because. <laughs> What's the point of these vaccines? Really, oh, you're really about the virus. virus. Okay, okay. Yeah, but the virus, the vaccines now, the one we took, it really, it really was. It really ain't gonna have no effect. Not like like if it keep mutating, like it just like shit. It just we just took a vaccine. As long as long, long the virus keep mutating, it's still like shit. It. I don't but think I feel like, else. but but at the same time. That's probably going to affect most people who who aren't vaccinated more so than people who are vaccinated. Oh yeah, but I think the new one, like the, the new one, the new screen, I don't think it's as severe as the original COVID nineteen. Cause it, mm-hmm. yeah, <laughs> a lot of people ain't di- ain't really dying from this. Yeah, right? they just people make not because if if they were actually dying dying from it, you would hear the reports on TV. And they don't yeah, even yeah. show the numbers like they used to show the numbers. They're just pretty much telling people that it's out, you know, you know, be aware, stay protected, get your vaccines, this, that, and the third. So, I mean, I feel like if we came this long with, you know, it, we don't have any other choice but just go ahead and just just live with it. I mean, it's not going to go nowhere. It's going to be here like the flu. Yeah, I so mean, we might, as well, we might as well just go ahead and just be precautious. Try to, you know, take whatever we can take to keep our immune system strong. It is here to stay at this point. Yeah, they say it's going to turn into... we're messing uh, them up. It's like uh, a common cold. But we're messing them up. Like, you know, with China, like how they other countries... Really, people scared because how, um, how other con- countries deal with uh, dealing with it. Mm. So they said it's going to turn into a, like, the basically like the flu in 2024. That's basically what they're saying. So, <laughs> say that again. You say this is gonna be like a, just another the flu to twenty twenty four. That's what they were saying, but you know, it's hearsay. But they're they they're saying on the news. I mean, when you think about it, as the virus mutates, sometimes it gets weaker, sometimes it gets stronger. But as more people that get vaccinated, it gets weaker. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah. weaker. Cause you think about it, do you even hear about chicken pox anymore? Uh, and people uh, getting vaccines. Yeah, you don't think about. I mean, none, none of that stuff. And even 
with the flu, you really don't even hear too many folks with flu. I mean, I've heard probably like one or two people say, you know, they got the flu, but you know, that's because people were getting vaccinated. Exactly. Yeah. So, so yeah, I mean, I ain't gonna tell nobody what they can and cannot do. I just recommend you go get that vaccination. I mean, yeah, think about yeah. it. If you thinking the government's trying to poison you, then they would have put it in the food. If they yeah, really yeah. wanted to do that shit. That they poison it anyway. It's in the food and shit. So, uh, so you shit. might well. Either I'm going to die from the vaccine or I'm going to die from COVID. It's either or so shit. I'm just going to live. Yeah. Yeah, it is where it is at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Either going to be COVID. Yeah. Yeah. Might as well. I mean, you might as well just take your chances and get the vaccine. And just like nowadays, when they start doing the mandates over, they ain't going to really see who's going to be taking that shit. Mm hmm. Yeah, that little shit. What are they doing that here? What are they doing that? But yeah, y'all got any plans besides like traveling? Is there anything y'all personal goals y'all trying to do next year? Yeah, I just said um, try, getting on the plane and probably uh, either trying to look into getting a house or just a bigger bigger space. But those are my two my two goals for next year. Okay. What about you, Trevor? Travel? They trying with. Yeah, probably buy a house. They won't get position to buy a house, but I think they say shit. You can't even try well, there. You can't take cruises, man, no more. And they count a lot of flights, man. So we're gonna yeah. have to even with the traveling and shit. I, I already know they um canceled the um the damn peach, but me next year I'm just trying to save as much money as I can and hopefully get a house. Oh yeah, and, yeah. Save money definitely gotta be it. And take my ass back to the gym. And that's about it. Yeah, because I, I ain't been seeing y'all at all. Ma'am, after Thanksgiving, <laughs> she just went down here. <laughs> Lord have mercy. I mean, I really haven't been like persistent as I should be, but I mean, I, I still been getting, you know, getting in at least once a week, <laughs> if anything. I feel you. I'd be going to the one over here by my house. And when I go work out with Drew, I'll be over there by the one you go to. So. Damn, Drew. Go work at the one at your house. Damn him. Go work at the one at your house. You know what? <laughs> the one at your house. The one at your house, they said, got the better equipment. Better they really do. Equipment. They really do. Because when I get on them treadmills over where y'all at, it'd be 30 minutes to, if I found the elliptical, it'd be 30 minutes. And sometimes it don't go as fast as the ones over there. I get over there. Yeah, because they're ready. Workout. They old. They need to upgrade the machines, man. It, I <laughs> might just go ahead and just upgrade my membership and get 20, but I would hate to go all the way by your house when that one right down the street from me. But True I wanna I wanna get newer equipment because he said my brother said over there they got like the ropes. Something with the ropes yeah, the, or something. Yeah, it's in the back, way in the back. So yeah, they got a little place you could duck off, and they got cables and stuff. So it's nice. It's kind of big. I mean, I've been I there before, but I just couldn't remember what the rope name was. Yeah, yeah. So they got this thing. Um, they got this hundred day envelope challenge thing. I'm gonna try to do, and I'm gonna do this. Um, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and do my get back on my regiment. I got my supplements and everything ready. Because tomorrow I'm we'll probably going to get drunk and stuff. And... Go and get drunk, Bill. Hmm? You can block it out. Go and get drunk, Bill. Oh, at my house. Oh, at your oh. house? Yeah, yeah, with my little wimpy whoop. So. Oh, there's nothing wrong with that. Get drunk with your whoop de whoop. <laughs> no, I, I, don't, I don't blame you. I don't yeah, blame you one sick. bit. <laughs> I think the whole club scared to go out in that hell shit. Them I ain't gonna lie to you. Oh I shit, these folks in Columbus scared as hell. Now ain't talking about no damn COVID. <laughs> Man, them hey, folks were outside. They were outside during the damn pandemic when they first started. These folks ain't saying COVID. 
I don't know. They scared now, nah, though. Everybody said they won't stay in now. Nah, they, they, they sick. Most of them uh, sick. Yeah, yeah, the whole city, the Columbus sick. Yeah, man. man. They said Kodak Black supposed to be coming to Columbus. I said, nope. I will not be out there at all. Nah. I don't even like Kodak Black. He all right. I ain't Let's even no big code. I mean, I ain't gonna say. Let me take that bang and say I don't like him. I'm just not a big code, but I feel like I ain't like. I just listen to all his music. But again, I don't listen oh, no. to hardly none of these new folks' music. They was um. Uh, I had went out last weekend. And they were playing. I don't know who them folks was. That how old I feel. I did not know nobody. <laughs> they was playing. I said, Lord have mercy. I gotta stop being so old. <laughs> I like that Leah get up. That was dope right there. I said, okay. Oh, yeah. I was thinking, when you trying to um, rock that other design, though? I knew you were going to air me sometime soon. <laughs> I guess I should go ahead and um, look into right. it. Cause I'm checking I want, Well, I want because, you know, I had ordered that Leah outfit for the longest. I just didn't really have nowhere to wear it, too. Yeah. So I really was just going to wait and wear uh, the outfit with the, the design that we came up with. When I know I was going to really go somewhere. Hey, whenever but you're I, ready. Ain't, I ain't got nothing for upcoming plan. Like, even for these, I really ain't got nothing planned. If you want to wait to spring, you can wait to spring. All right. Yeah, that might be a uh, better look when it warm up a little bit. Because I don't even think I'm going to really be doing nothing for the next few few months here. For real, for real. I ain't doing shit. Yeah, I'm going to I'm cook, chill. I ain't gonna lie to you. I was like, bro, I went to that movie theater. I was like, uh uh-uh. uh, it's kind of, kind of, kind of uh, crowded up in here. So people was at the movie theater. Shiny, they say people go to the movies for real. Hell yeah, everybody be on Netflix now. Oh, yeah, yeah you know, I just want to go see that. Oh, go ahead. Spider Man. It's like, yeah, yeah some, movie, they, some movie, they don't start just putting back, like, what, in theaters only. Can't scream. Um. Mm. Yeah, and I guess they just go for certain movies or for like little date night or some. I don't know, but most people here be on damn Netflix looking at stuff. Netflix and chill. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So groovy. What do you um? How was this whole year to you? Uh, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> It made me realize Pete some shit. Like my, it was it was a real eye opener. But sorry, I'm packing right now. Are oh, you good? Take your time. Uh, it was a real eye opener, but uh, I'm back on my feet. Just finna get ready for the move into my apartment. And, uh, that's all I'm really waiting on. For. I think it was good because me and you got our new jobs together at the same time. Like the same, like we started our first jobs on the same day. We've been oh, yeah. progressing. I first seen everybody. Out. Like everybody been progressing, man. Especially, you know, especially you with your photography and everything, man. You're doing good. I appreciate it. We're going to take a break, but like I put on IG that, uh, a photographer in California liked one of my pictures, and he got that blue check on there, so that kind of motivated me to keep going. So, you know what I'm saying, man, you got it. You got what a burger. It was a rainbow and match. I said, shit, dude, I probably went home then. I come to work yesterday. Had enough talking about rainbows today. You said what? Say, I had enough talking about rainbows today. I was about to say something. <laughs> That's stupid. I was like, why they got that shit on there? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna I'm still do photography, but I'm kind of. I just felt like this year I did I did like a lot, like I was posting back to back. So I'm gonna try something different. Like I got some. I'm still editing pictures, but like I might just post them like every now and then. I ain't gonna do them like because I used to do like three posts a day. Yeah. So I'm just gonna probably do like one a week or 
One at the beginning Ooh. of the week, one at the end of the week. And, um, I did a lot of did a lot of shit this year. It's been one, it's been one for the ages. Yeah, you know, I just want everybody to be safe next year. Everybody just get that money, get that bag, do what the hell you want to do. Well, eventually I'm gonna have to leave the city of Columbus. Really. Eventually. Because we get in too long. And Georgia. Maybe Georgia. But. You got to leave. There you go. I plan on moving after my own lease is up. I feel you. Well, I'll throw a party and everything. Everybody get drunk and stuff. But yeah, <laughs> y'all staying in for the New Year's? Just chilling. Yeah, yeah, I gotta work. I don't know my um my home girl. She just want to go to Mister Wing just to watch the game. So I might just go there just to chill for a minute, get That's a drink or two, and then come my ass back home. I'm going to the definitely. Okay, I mean, my, it's not too my much. My friend caught that shit. At- no, I was talking about you said you just get on, just get back home. Yeah, um, plus I mean, I it's gonna be raining and all that. Yeah, both stormy. You know, yeah, both stormy in tomorrow. That shit yeah, yeah. rough. I like, yeah. I called Saturday, I think. Yeah, Wonder why I was <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm gonna be like, yeah, I'm Oh, that man! Every time he do it, shit, right? <laughs> Just the, yeah, y'all don't, y'all don't pick up on shit. I be snowing. <laughs> oh, you all right? Hmm. I told you, he's all right. I got it was storm right here. Oh, you care about me? <laughs> I went to sleep, woke up, and it was raining bad. I said, "What the hell?" Oh, uh, trial. Yo. Uh, at work, you looked at the board. Yeah. About room one. Yeah. Go ahead, update it. I put the yeah, date on there. For- yeah, I put, I put, yeah, I, I put, I turned it to, I put Thursday, and I, yeah, I did it. Shit, put seven. I'm about to tie the hell out. I ain't on that shit. <laughs> she on. I don't care if we record it. Are we recording? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> When I had to wrestle with her ass, she grabbed me on my uh, chest. I said, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> mm-hmm. I'm tired of these niggas, man. <laughs> Dang. Day, day 34. I'll take this out. <laughs> I'll leave it in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that man said, he, that man walked in, Julie said, you mad today? I said, nope. <laughs> He asked him about the shoe this morning. I said, I don't know. You got, you got to talk to Trey about that. He, walk, he walked off. And I walked right behind him. He slammed the door. And I called him. I said, you thought you was going to slam some shit today. <laughs> Sit your ass down. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what they problem is. Shit. Oh, man. But yeah, man. We're going to do a lot of we're going to do a lot of live episodes next year. I'm telling Santa Claus don't exist. <laughs> Ooh, I don't give a fuck. Hey, man, the since they got them presents. <laughs> I don't give them shit. Yeah. Oh, shout out to uh, shout out to the plug. They recently got what they got. They got, somebody came in and just robbed it. Yeah, they broke into them. Mm-hmm. I seen that. That, that was on the news right. in LA, yeah. wasn't it? Uh huh. You know, shout out to them. That's you great. Know, hopefully, hopefully everything gets better and better. We appreciate the live episode you did for the niggas. I'll take it back. Yes, sir. We'll do more live episode. Have guests. Have some wild guests come up there and talk crazy, I guess. We'll do something. <laughs> do, um, <laughs> and do that one on... Uh, one day we'll uh-huh. do the Battle of the Sexes episode. I'll do something. If y'all got people y'all want to bring on, shoot, just ask me. Hurry up. We got to wake up early. Long enough. 
So. <sighs> popcorn is here, too. Now what? Who popcorns in the cabin? Mine, put it down. God damn. damn. What? Huh? So what? Can I have them? Then I say put them down. I put them down. I ain't gonna listen. <laughs> you gonna be like how my dad get on me? I just say you said. You at work? Uh huh. Oh, you see you bring that in. Yeah, nah, it was storming too bad. God damn, boy. I was supposed to tell you some lunch. Oh, I like shit. Get on there. They, um, they have snacks. Oh, they right. have snacks, man. We eat popcorn. Oh, it's on the counter. No, it's on the counter. Then <laughs> Drew's ass on the counter. Yeah, Drew's ass. Oh, no, you can't have that. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Shell. It's the principal. <laughs> supposed to share. Sharing is caring. Right she was talking right to me. No, I mean, just... Who left me free? I got fruit loose and everything. She was talking to me. That's how you're going to fuck with me. I can't make no fruit. I ain't drink no milk here. It's a long time for you to... Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all niggas are crazy. Y'all niggas are crazy. Lord, have mercy. Yeah, I don't make no milk, especially here, bud. Yeah, what's going on? Mm-mm. Yes, yeah, man. It's 2022. And we appreciate y'all tuning in every week. It's been going on when it hits February. It's going to be an episode for the last two years every week. Well, hold on. Let me cut y'all. What you said, Trey? Oh, I said, oh I'm going to eat the popcorn anyway. Yeah, but besides that, you said 2022. You said 2222. Yeah. 222. Right. <laughs> no, don't, don't defend him. <laughs> It is 22. 222. 222. <laughs> hey, Drew. Yo. Aha! Shut your ass. Oh, yeah. My head told me what you did, Drew. What I did? Don't worry about it. What I did? <laughs> Replay, yeah, man. That's a, yeah. No. <laughs> what are you talking about? Replay. What's the replay? We'll talk about it later. <laughs> what do you got to do with? <laughs> we well, used talking about one of cruises. Talking about what? Not man. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all talking to each other? What you say? I didn't even say it. <laughs> So you, you want to bust me out, but then you don't want to talk about, about it. For you. Now I'm talking. I'm talking to Trey. <laughs> <laughs> what do y'all yeah, elaborate? Ain't funny. Elaborate what you're talking about. Mm. My buddy. This has right, been so a gentle part. Yeah, part. Nah, I bet. Yeah. That's why I be yeah. quit. <laughs> he just, he just, he just cut you off. I'm sorry, dude. But nah, for real though, I really appreciate like from you know what I'm saying. I appreciate everybody who helped this podcast and everything. I'm gonna keep on saying it because I'm really like legit, just glad that we came together and just made this shit into something special. And we're gonna take it to the next level for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Chill, so chill, 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 chill. You know what I'm saying? You got some FR. For real, for real. So yeah, we're gonna do that. And um Cause we got some dope individuals on this team that bring something to the table and we're just going to keep on progressing. And then we're just going to give y'all some dope shit to, you know, to vibe with. And we're going to give y'all some dope merch. And it's coming soon. What's the website uh, drop? Apologies to Wesley Snipes. I'm sorry, yes, Wesley we apologize Snipes. to Wesley Snipes. Yeah, sorry, Nick. You know what you're doing. <laughs> I'm telling him that. <laughs> I'm telling him. We got to meet him. I'm telling him I'm sorry. So... Motherfucker, you out of your mind? But we want to say, you know, Happy New Year's to you and your family. We appreciate y'all for tuning in every day for the last two years, going on every week. Two years for the every week. You ain't ain't correct, Mike. I'm busy right now. (laughs) I can't help. I'm I'm occupied with Mike talk. 
<laughs> you talk, I'm not like a cop. Don't, don't be trying. Right. We're all buddies. Yeah, we are. Are we? Yeah. I don't know now. Mm-mm. Yeah, so. But yeah, man. So, anybody want to say anything before they go? Are we already done? Oh, no. what you got to do? Talk your shit, now. Uh, I thought y'all doing like an hour. <laughs> yeah, been over here by now. <laughs> Talk your shit, Andrew McCoy. Ooh, I ain't got no shit to pop. Oh. <clears throat> I'm, talking, I'm on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn! I ain't even know she was in the middle. I ain't know. <laughs> we can this. Well, I hope y'all succeed more next year. I don't know what y'all goals are, but I hope y'all reach them. Shit. With the power of friendship, we can all do it. Oh, shut the fuck up. Loyalty. <laughs> 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 hey, like the after school special. Hey yo, <laughs> why you be talking like? Why you be having all these damn inspirational speeches? I said I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That might be a football coach. <laughs> we can do it, boy. We can do it. You can do it. They put on the same cleats. Go out there and lose seventy to zero. <laughs> you suck. You may suck. I keep looking at this video, that lady Kyle L. Smith. Hey, soon as somebody cough, <laughs> hey, that man said, fuck you. That shit. Uh, try to put up with the church later. <laughs> Let the fuck on. <laughs> now that, that she had a number, say, bring her back in here. What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, it's all good though. It's the Gen Top Podcast. We got motherfucking Groovy Drew. We got Shell, and we got Trav. We appreciate y'all from year 2021, and we're going beyond and beyond to 222. <laughs> 222. What is zero? That's my thing about it. It's two z. It's, it's it's twenty. It's two zero. Two twenty two. Hey, Mike. You say I am not letting y'all slide ever I'm again. Not <laughs> ever. <laughs> oh, this Mike. I just say this Mike might post it. I said, man, she fine. What? We recording, ain't we? Yes. Okay, all right. <laughs> you say that now. <laughs> Go heat up that popcorn. <laughs> okay, I don't know who, who popcorn it is. It might. I told you. Can I have it? Fuck no. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, eat, man. But eat them damn chip mix they got. Hell nah. <laughs> that shit tell I take. Tell me in no desert. Tell me in no desert with Drew. Drew, look at you. Hey man, I I, I dropped my bread. I'm gonna look at you with too damn fucking bad. bad. <laughs> <laughs> too fucking bad. Just be more careful. You know that's the last time you got it. My bread. <laughs> If you were smart, you would put it in your pocket, but you want to drop it. <laughs> I guess some of your bread. You can't have my bread. <laughs> you think I run like oh, that? Yeah. You ain't going to chase me. You <laughs> 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 were like, no, this is my bread. <laughs> this is mine. You like SpongeBob, you know, the chocolate that him and Patrick got stranded out in there. Oh, what's going on? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> No, no, <laughs> don't do it, SpongeBob. Don't, it's more. <laughs> That's it, fun of you. So, we're doing a lot more live episodes. 
Right, we're gonna figure it out. Probably when everything gets cleared in the springtime, we'll do a live episode, and then we can try to do the if we can get some women who can co- cooperate and not talk over each other, we can do battle of the sexes. And like you said, oh, I'm gonna eat your popcorn, Drew. I bring some most. Oh, we can come back at work. <laughs> I said, fuck you, all you that. just don't listen, man. <laughs> Is it yours for real? No. Okay. <laughs> I know the one here. I said, I ain't no sitting in the park. I'm here. Oh, no. How are you going to assume I don't eat popcorn at work? Because I don't know be in here. You don't be there. I be there. Yeah, so I got to deal with that, do with that bullshit every day. Yeah, it seemed like I had to do it. Stop, 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 stop. I said, you know, I'm going to get ready to drag. I said, I'm going to sit your ass. I said, get your ass in that room. She came to the thing. I was talking about She came to the thing about old time. I said, talk to I said, shit, he busy. Get the fuck on. I said, Trav, I said, Trav, I was like, would you let it go? Newsflash. <laughs> I'm telling you, when I get back, I'm going to tell him Santa Claus dead. Why did you say that? She started crying. She hit that. She hit that. You know how she did that? I'm going to get the whole house. I'm going to get the whole house riled up. <laughs> so with one of y'all first, man, we put them glue or something. <laughs> mm-hmm. Room number two, not, no, not to fuck with me. <laughs> <laughs> Only one that deserved the Christmas was uh, room number four. Yeah. If she ain't that she ain't, she ain't gonna be that loud no more. Bobby he told mm-hmm. he won't do it. He, told, he gave her confidence that she don't be good. She ain't that loud no more. But she forgot him. God damn. Let Justin Bieber come on. She is she gonna start wailing. Damn, they sold out of this damn a little shirt I had. I don't even know. Yeah, I should know where you got to buy the shit when you first see the shit. Man, I, I said the same for uh, Boohoo. I missed a whole bunch of shit. I got to wait till next year. So that shit like, in stock. Yeah, that's why I just been saying, see, they like out of stock in a lot of shit because it's in the whole stock with Cole. <laughs> hey, we, I forgot we were <laughs> You know what I'm saying? You know who bought it all? <laughs> who? who? Our friend Michael. Mm-hmm. You said what? You bought all that shit. You bought what? And watch it goop. And R.I.P. John Madden. Mike got hit him with a boom. You got a hundred pop. Do that. Hey, my nigga. My nigga <laughs> tried to get the words wrong. Right out my motherfucking mouth, bro. I don't dare you right to say that shit. Oh, man. I was going to make a... I was going to say Mike... I was going to say Mike, appropriate. I was gonna say Mike <laughs> should do a skit about somebody cheating, but he do like the uh, play-by-play with John, like John Madden with the yellow uh, highlight. <laughs> He can oh, change, oh, not going inside. He's locking oh, the some, door. Or oh, with somebody cooking. <laughs> Where's oh, the season? Oh, yeah, you don't see no season on that chicken. That's a bad play, Bob. I feel you, John. What else he's going to do? <laughs> and the mashed potatoes are still lumpy. Whip it. You got to whip it. Whip it you know, my good. grandma used to whip it. You know, God bless, Bob. God bless, Francis. You know what I'm saying? But she used to whip it. You put some collard greens on that That's bitch. Right. Boom. No. And that goes to show here. I already thought of it. I did. <laughs> Are you ready? I was going to do one when you have to, you had sex, the little post interview like everybody be doing. Oh, yeah. On TikTok. Yeah, I was going to have a bad performance. So how you did? Uh, you know, yeah, yeah. Things happen. You just got to go back and regroup. So. <laughs> and make a, yeah, man, you wet. <laughs> 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 So why are you hearing all these rumors saying that your short game is weak? Well, next question. She, she said, I was like, well, she yeah, just talking about choice, but next question. <laughs> had, going, going into the game, I had a wish, girl. And I had a growing injury. I'm going to say she this. Was, mm-hmm. This is the y'all. Y'all, y'all listen to that Niggas for Life album by uh, NWA? Mm-hmm. Oh, no yeah. No fast album. It is a lot of they they did what three songs like with the same beat and the samples and shit. I think I believe so. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, Try we, to uh, say, put the balls in your mouth and hum. 
Get it all, baby. <laughs> what do you want me to do with it? No man, I just don't buy the cheese so I it. I was like, damn, this fit the Gen Talk podcast vibe. <laughs> 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 Oh, I said Dr. Dre is funny with these samples. Oh, hell yeah. But can she suck a good dick? Like, what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> but yeah. This has been a Gen Talk podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be the last words we say for the year. See you next year. You know, see you next year. You know what I'm saying? And as always, in the jungle, You're going to do it right, do it right. <laughs> that was a tad better. <laughs> I'm going Harambe. Harambe. Go ahead. They're going to get at your sister. <laughs> I could do the do. All right, y'all. Can I tell you? It ain't gin talking what you talking about. Cause all you freaky bitches want some dick in your mouth. See, I know you niggas.